हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द प्लांटर गेम्स हम लोग खेल रहे हैं गार्डियन ऑफ द गैलेक्सी मार्वल गेम सो फार गेम इज ब्यूटीफुल जो चीज मेरे को समझ में आई इट्स लाइक प्री किड फ्रेंडली सो मेरे को मजा आ रहा था विदाउट द वेडिंग मैच लाइक चैंपियन एंड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल थैंक यू फॉर ऑल द सपोर्ट दैट आई एम गेटिंग आई एम गेटिंग यू गाइस आर ऑसम चलिए ऑन दैट अलोन वी आर एग्रीड सो लेट्स सी दिस we can use rocket can you extend that cannon with my brute animal strength <laughs> no okay i guess drag i think you can drag this cannon out i will try dude is awesome man is more stubborn than expected Not stay in place. You couldn't just hold Drax. Can you try again? Why? It does not stay. I'm working it out. Trust me. I, I cannot hold it forever. You've got to find a way to lock it. Obviously. Why will you not yield? Because it's attached to a recoily thing. You're sure that's Drax. Can you try again? So come to me, fiendish machine. I did it. Impressive, you will. Now we got to get the next one out. out that higher cannon impossible it is too far from the ground for the record i killed 4675 chitauri during the war you count it it is an estimate okay well all i'm saying is that while you were killing grunts i was taking down the ones giving the orders ever hear of grullux no really who is this grullux why does this matter <laughs> it don't matter much to me, but there's about a million civilians who owe their lives to this sneaky lady. No one owes me anything. Killing him was too much fun. Group, any way you could bring that one down with vines or something? <laughs> He says his vines ain't strong enough to move them things. that cannon I can but I won't be able to get it out if that's what you want You know when it comes to taking out Shatari Drax has a couple of big notches on his belt too. I heard he took out Warbringer. Warbringer isn't dead. You sure? Very sure. But who was the freaky one you killed, Drax? I do not concern myself with what the Chitauri scum called one another. Rocket, any ideas on getting that top one out? Not from this angle, no.
Rocket, I need you to squeeze inside that little hole and try to knock the gun loose from the inside. Hello, Shatari ship, full of booby traps and death mechanisms. But you love both those things. Uh, you're right, I do. And I always wanted to see the inside of one of these bug bombers. Fine. Okay, that's nice. Oh, what reeks in here? That's... Oh, Scott. Ah. Are you okay in there, Rocket? I found the crew. I guess not even the worms want to eat dead Shatari meat. Rocket. Relax. Just gonna reroute the little bit of remaining power to the cannon and... Nothing. You know what, Larkin? I'm blowing it up. What? Hang on. Think about all the booby traps and. Oh, okay, that's mine. Ha! Look at it go. He must have jump started the thing. Rocky, you okay? <laughs> yeah. And dry now too. Gamora, can you clear us a path through that junk? Yes, you can. Yes, Peter Quill. Onward to the palace of the great giantess. Oh man, another murder tentacle. Careful, it might be playing dead. Radiation's gone into gear, that's all. Why does it... That is not a happy monster. Well, at least it left. Back to its brood mother, Lady Hellbender. Oh. Yeah, I doubt it. Come on, why is the bridge always on the wrong side? This time I insist we hurl the foul beast. And I insist we push muscles over the side of the cliff. To what end? Yours! <laughs> you are... How many times do I have to say it? We're not throwing rocket. Ridiculous. You were holding us back to spare the beast's feelings. When has he done the same for us? Put him down. Just be a lesson to Oh, I'll show you what a lesson looks like. Knock it off, guys! We're supposed to be professionals. We're better than this. Stop wasting time arguing. We'll find another way across. This is what I've been trying to do. I know. I'm just doing some exploring. Ain't we done enough of that already? I'm pretty sure exploring is code. It means he went the wrong way, but it's too stubborn to admit it. I sure hope that buttless beast ain't running back to mommy to tell on us. Should have aimed for its head, Gamora. At least I should have been appended. What did you do? Hey, that thing is like seriously broken. Everything okay, Peter? Yeah, just you know, turning water into ice. Go off. I used to believe that the rodent had the most impressive firearm in our group. I've changed my mind. I think I can see my house from here. What are you doing up there? Scout type stuff. Scouting. Looks like we uh need to keep going towards the fortress and not away from it. Excellent work, Peter. There's usually some acting involved in this kind of infiltration. Lady Hellbender is an astute buyer. Either she will want what we are selling, or she will not. Mm, I'm with Gamora on this one. Look in the part is half the back. Who is this? Take your word for it, bud. Take his word for what? He says the soil here is like supercharged with plant nutrients. Give him a little bit of a buzz just walking on it. Oh. Let's see where we can go. Thanks. 
Could you move a bit to the right? Why? Hey, you think they look like a bunch of tiny rockets trying to get out of the rain? Cool dude, Groot. Hey, uh, since we got a sec, you've known Rocky way longer than I have. You know he can be kind of unpredictable, temperamental even, feisty. What I'm asking is, is he gonna be able to go through with this? That sounded like a yes. Good. Thanks, man. Okay, how do you cross this? Why are you touching me? You have some jelly on your pants. I don't see you cleaning me off. Okay, I am not. If we can't get across it, maybe we can go around it. Looking for cracks, caves, or crevices, people. I feel like I've heard you say that before, but in a different context. In many ways, this planet reminds me of my own world. Not that bad, huh? Katath is not a place for the weak. The punishing weather and lethal predators force every Katathian to fight for survival. Guys, I've got something here. It's deep. This looks promising. There is little room to maneuver if something should attack. We're not gonna be here long. Anybody see a way through? We'll make one if we have to. Oh, anybody else smell that? It really stinks back here. Yes, it smells putrid. <sighs> Where is it coming from? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, not talking. <gasps> Not even breathing. Do we know anything about Lady Hellbender's demeanor? You said that Anyone she... but Drax? I just heard that she's fair but terrifying. Yep. Definitely something gross behind here. Are you rude? Drax, can you chuck that through the stink wall? I fear I will regret this. My god, that's gonna stink that like that. Disturbingly fragrant. Looks like somebody's in the sign, huh? I am clenching every orifice. Okay, that's kinda weird. Hello? Anybody? Whoa! <laughs> okay, that got my <clears throat> blood pumping. Why would Lady Hellbender cage this girl? What the hell? Because uh, it's annoying as scud. Perhaps it is food. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter. That's a monster food. Like that? can use this. You know, we really got monster food? Your taste, but the cage. You get it? We need the cage. Taste we go into that fortress with our, with our monster peacefully walking beside us. We'll be laughed right out of the room. Why are you whispering? Gamora thinks we can sell our monster act better if we have a proper cage. Only problem is, there's a pissed off monster inside. Release the beast, let me dispose of it. Because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan of attack. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety as leader. Rocks it's a My god. And a fuck. Oh my god, not him again. Get a two of them?
That's it. We better hurry. That's small. Uh, first rain, then jelly, then slimy, stinky crawl spaces, and now all these monsters. I hate this flarking planet. You hate everything, Rocket. True, but especially the stinky slime tunnel part. Itchy fur is where I draw the line. Hey, we're a team. If we're gonna smell like butt, we're gonna smell like butt together. That is most eloquent, Peter Quill. I will smell like butt with you. Yeah, really great speech. Oh, Seknarf ain't never heard of roads. You'd have to clear parts of the jungle to do it, which would probably mean killing some of the wildlife. Good. They deserve it. Seknarf 9 is a sanctuary. I say that if you leave behind a single piece of refuse, Lady Hellbender will personally return it to you in the most unpleasant way. That can't be true.
takes years of special training to operate these things. You had years of jet boot lessons. No, but the guy I took them off of did. You stole them. He was Okay, let's go ahead. That thing heavy, Quill? Surprisingly light. If we put our monster in it, will he shrink as well? Uh, no. It would compress anything inside to a mound of twitching gold. <laughs> Neat. Don't get any ideas. Give it a slice, Gamora. Way's not clear. Okay, now what? So, what do we do if all don't go well with Lady H? We're gonna fight a monster queen? She would be a formidable adversary indeed. Lady Hellbender isn't her adversary. If all goes well, she's gonna be our business partner. And if all don't That's go well, snake, then we'll man. know we should have sold Groot instead. Okay, that's not it. Okay, got it. No, <laughs> Deep freeze. Whoa! Can I try ice cubing something? Nope. Man, you're such a gas flat. So if we're gonna haggle with the monster queen, how much are we asking for our monster? 395 million units, give or take two. One for every precious hair follicle on this flawless body. Group, give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. Pretty sure it's this way, but I don't see an easy way to get up there. Easy is rarely worth the effort. For you, maybe. I love easy. So who's next in line for the throne if Lady Hellbender has an action? Perhaps she is immortal. Nobody's immortal. Not even death herself. I can't believe you just said that with a straight face. We're finally in. Definitely in my top ten fortresses. What the, fuck? what the hell? You said that quarantine zone monster was supposed to be rare. She already has a whole herd of them. So we wasted our time. Almost got killed for nothing. And got arrested. That was fun. It was moderately amusing. Now we've got a ticking time bomb on the ship. And we owe money to the cops. Guys, every misstep was just a step in the right direction towards completing our best plan yet. Say that again? What if we brought one of those ugly suckers all the way here only to find out Lady H already had a full set? That would have sucked big time. Exactly. If we even got that far, what if we'd been towing that thing when Novacore intercepted us? They would have taken our beast. See? This is working out. And all the things. Bumpy, chaotic For a bunch way, of... but we've still got a plan. What the hell is that? Are those various? Oh, those are bees. Okay, let's see. Let's just get this done. What the hell? That's you. You can't be serious. Okay. It's farther than it looked. Much farther. It's a flark in infinity bridge, is what it is. Are uh, you being dramatic, Rodent? 
Bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not infinite. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. Recycles. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Oh! Right! The cage. The point of even getting the Flarkin thing is looking like a mean business. All right, Rocket. Time to put on your monster face. I only got one face, Quill. Are you sure about this, Peter? <laughs> Look at him! You better have one hell of a sales pitch. Maybe Gamora's right. We should try selling Groot instead. Oh, what? Really? This is an affront to democracy. I just think that we might need Rocket on the outside for this one. Peter Quill. We're not a democracy, Drax. <sighs> yeah, we noticed. You want to make that call, then you better not mess this up. Do hang tight there, bud. When the time comes, I'll get you out of there. Rocket style. Drat. Gamora, can you help me with no. this? What? Why? To guarantee your safety as a leader. Ah, oh, come on. Oh uh, don't look at me. I ain't pulling that thing. Remember, buddy, menacing like me, only uh, bigger. Not bad. Not bad. I should have done it, though. Nah, I should not have changed. Oh, it's okay. Okay, here we go. This is beautiful, man. Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called... Please stop. All right, yeah. Okay. Wait, is Please Stop the name of your song? No. Okay. Whoa. Okay, whoa, whoa. A little bit close. Easy, big guy. Don't know what you heard, but we just want to bring you back a new friend. I know it can't understand me, but maybe it responds good to soothing tones. Are we there yet? So that hellbender lady, like whatever the name is. Campfire like. song or something we could sing to kill the time. Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called... Please stop. All right, yeah. Okay. Wait, is Please Stop the name of your song? No. Okay. So, how long really before ready. someone else wants to pull this thing? We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. Well, there is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0 0.9. 2.1 0 0.3 clicks 4.5 0 0.4 clicks 0 0.5 clicks 0 0.6 click clicks for the love of war stop counting clicks we could enumerate all the ways in which our flag like like that why the hell this is not as you got them Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. Oh man, this is gonna be so cool. Be warm enough to spend the night in the yard soon. I love falling asleep looking at the stars, wondering what might be out there.
Mom says Grandpa used to play this a lot when she was a kid. But it's been busted ever since I can remember. Well, 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 look who decided to finally come up. Where's my cake? I warned you. <laughs> no, you didn't. I am so full. Mom. Oh. <gasps> okay, sit your butt down, Slowpoke. Don't worry, I'm not gonna sing. I like your singing. Well, you might be the only one. Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. Look at all those girlfriends. Someone's gonna be really popular at school. Mom. What? Okay. You are very handsome. I'm sure all the girls are gonna be falling off. Mom. Out. What did you what wish happened for? To that? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh. What huge favor are you about to ask me? Just ten bucks. Dan, Andy, and I want to go see Night of the Cosmos at the Rio tonight. A movie? Tonight. Come on. It's gonna be sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. I don't think I want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one, and you were sleeping in my bed the next three nights. That was ages ago, and this one isn't even that bad. It's PG-13, and I'm 13. Exactly, PG-13 may contain violence and nudity. Mild nudity, like butts and stuff. You're not helping your case. No, I just, I, I wanted us to have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win. We can still do all that stuff, or some of it, tomorrow. You're always telling me to get out of the house more. A movie theater does not count as out of the house, and you know it. Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. There's been a lot of weirdos out there. It's not safe. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you I, I know. was- I know! You were standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No. Of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about. Something I want to give you. Twenty bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. No, I was talking to Janie's mom the other day. Little guy put up a big fight. Wouldn't have been able to land him without Grandpa's tricks. Where's Mama's room? Okay, this is it. I miss him so much. Grandma used to take me into town on Sundays to run errands. We'd stop for ice cream on the way home. Even in winter. Man, am I glad I finally got my hair the way I like it. Sometimes Grandma and Grandpa would let me sleep with them if I was too afraid down in the basement. I could just like grandparents home. Okay, that's the one. I don't know much about art, 
but I know that this is excellent. Grandma really had talent. What's in the back? At last! Well? Huh? We have arrived at the Monster Queen's fortress. At its entrance. At entrance. Okay, so guys, uh, this was it for this video. In our next ap episode, we are going to open up another chapter, which is the Queen's Palace. So until then, have a great day. Bye-bye. Love you all.